You know what I mean? It was like Animal House every night. First so off, crazy. passing down imaginations and every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of the most high. All right. Oh, oh, so, right. I'm sorry. I was, we, everybody got it. <laughs> that stirred everybody's spirit up. And bringing it to captivity it's every ugly. thought to the obedience of the Hawashah. Yeah, because this whole system is set up against the Most High and His laws. America was a country founded by Freemasons, right? And that's why they set America up as a country where you got so-called religious freedom. You can worship whatever God you want in America. And they're bringing all these uh, uh, demonic uh, religions, all these spirits and demons over here. they importing all these heathens and Hindus and Africans and uh, Somalians. And they bring it all. But actually, that's a good thing. You know, the, the, that's the most, that's just because it, that's fulfilling prophecy. That's why America is called Babylon the Great. Because there's conf nothing but confusion out here. One person is a goddamn Hindu, the next person is a, 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 a Buddhist monk, Shaolin. Star Wars. Star, yeah, mo next motherfucker is, uh, he really believes in the force. <laughs> he learned from Yoda. You know, you know, a Jedi is an official religion, right? Yeah, yes. In England, Jedi is recognized as an official religion. That's uh, crazy. That's big. You got a Scientology church right there. You got, you got, oh, don't even talk about the different branches of Christianity. That's endless. You, you got Seventh day of Venice, Baptist, Methodist. There's nothing but confusion. Ain't nobody on the same page. And then here it is, they read out the same book, but everybody got different views, which if I read a book like like we read, we all on one page. You feel me? Like, like we read the same book. Yeah. Didn't we? <laughs> like, are you sure you read it? Are you sure you read it? Right, that's why we like, are you sure y'all read that? <laughs> yeah, that's the only book. It's the only book. Like I read Lord of the Rings. Yeah. I never heard you come up and say the uh it's that, a necklace. <laughs> they was chasing a necklace. Yeah, they had a necklace or uh, that comprehension. Their Frodo didn't make it to Mount Doom or or, 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 or oh yeah. The, the, the <laughs> yeah, they did try. It's the only book where they change the story. They say don't mean really, don't really say what it said. They don't do that to no other book. Right, Just the right, scripture. Right, the scriptures say the Lord came for the lost sheep of the house of Israel. And oh, they try, oh, they be like, no, no, no. No. <laughs> they read no. a scripture. They like, they, they have that been, don't mean yeah, what it that says. Don't mean that. that don't mean what that says. Get that down pat. Down pat. <laughs> yeah. But, that, but they'll, they'll bring out some other scripture that's in, kind of ambiguous to try to damage control. That's all everybody's in constant damage control. John Hey, shit, dude. Polite now. Motherfuckers read the book of the day and got that down pat. Mm. You know? When you read certain shit though, this is our only king. Like it's no other verse you can get. They they bring out John sixteen. And then it repeats itself in Matthew ten. It says only to Israel, but it's supposed to mean something else. They say all. Oh, they say uh, we all Israelites. Everybody. Look, y'all. What's that? You owe me one. What, what's that old saying? What's that? Old? It looks like we down with the Who that? Oh yeah. Sure. But what's the old hillbilly city like? Oh, fool me once, shame on me. You know George Bush <laughs> fucked it up. Y'all yeah. ain't no shame on us, bro. We know the scripture. You ain't gonna tell me I don't know how to read. Yeah. Hey, just get the scripture. I know how to read. Y'all ain't, y'all ain't, y'all ain't, ain't, ain't gonna do me like that. Corinthians 2 and 17 it says for well, we are not as many which corrupt the word of God oh yeah we are not as why we forget about that what is that first Christian what we used to bring this out all the time 2 and, what? Two and 17 what? you gotta read that again yeah. we are not as many which corrupt the word of God yeah we are not as many who corrupt the word of God so we ain't corrupting it but the scriptures say the Lord only came for the Israelites. Guess what we're going to teach? We're going to teach that he only came for the Israelites. We're not, we're not going to sit and say the scriptures said something different. Just like, uh, like these other dumbass Israelite camps out here too, man. They be fucking scriptures up too. Yeah, they, they fuck all the scriptures up. Oh, shit. 
That is a good point, though. They always, <laughs> they, that's the only, the only book they fuck up is the Bible. They didn't want to say, well, the Bible got so many different translations and shit. Why, why? They're trying to confuse Well, you know, me. of course you're going to have different translations because it's different motherfuckers that speak different language. Well, they people, they just heard perfect. somebody say that's so over here. People say shit. But uh, guess what? Every Bible, you can look up all the translations. All the translations. We get every translation in existence. I already did it. <laughs> they want to say it. Every Matthew 15 and 24 says, I'm only sitting to Israel. No matter how many, no matter. We can get the Greek, we can get the Hungarian, we can get the. Oh, yeah, I've seen the Russian one even. Ooh, I forget what it said. Uh, only. Yeah, he said only to Israel. Uh, only. Well, because I looked it up in Russian, I looked it up in Finnish, I looked it up in all the languages. Because I wanted to be so angry. The translation was wrong. Yeah, Russian book of God Church. Oh, yeah. Hey, but a lot of them Russians, they take their scriptures seriously. Hey, hey, because you know the preaching the word going out to Russia. You're going to have you gonna have camps up in Russia. They're going to try to beat the shit out of them. Because Putin said there's only one church, and that's the uh, Orthodox church. You know that? Putin outlawed all the other churches. Yeah, it's, it's illegal to evangelize unless you're the Orthodox. Yeah, the Lord, the Lord going to wake people up in every nation on earth teaching his word. Proverbs 30 and 6, add thou not unto his word. Ooh, add, the, <laughs> add it onto it. When you say all nations can be saved, you add into the word. When you're saying uh, you can be a faggot, that's adding to the word. When you're saying you can eat shrimp like G-Man, that's adding to the word. Ooh. Oh, the, yeah, the most high name don't matter, but he said <laughs> one of the Ten Commandments says don't take the Lord's name in vain, but the Lord's name don't matter. Okay. Let, add thou not unto his words, lest he reprove thee, and thou be found a liar. So right, y'all get found a liar. That's why we, it's easy to prove these liars. Like, what was we just talking about? How, uh, you know, all these people, they say, the Lord didn't really mean it when he said he only came for Israel. They actually say that. He didn't really mean that. <laughs> I mean, what do you mean he didn't really mean it? What's that? What do you mean he don't really mean it? He was, he was lying? Or because it's the New Testament, either way. That's what they do. Is that the Old or New Testament? But Matthew, Matthew, where's Matthew at? Maybe I don't know the Bible. Maybe is Matthew in the New Testament? Two things have I required of you. Deny me him not before I die. Remove far from me vanity and lies. Yeah, we don't, yeah, get away from us. We don't want your lies. We vocab Malone and G-Man and faithful to God. They got nothing but lies. All, all they do, they just ambassadors for Esau. Really, they don't even care about the heathen nations. Really, they on a mission to save Esau. That's all they talk about. Why you say that about talk, they talk about Edomites? You know, they don't never take up for Ham or Cush. They trying to save Esau in particular. They just want to save Esau. Because they know in their spirit that they, they, they think they Edomites. And they, 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 they don't want to go to slavery. I mean, I don't blame them. Who would want to go into slavery, right? But you, get, but you can't, if, if you're an actual Edomite, you're going into slavery. That's just the way it is. It's the rules. That's the. You just want to have to pray to the most high when you're a slave. You just get one on one jobs where. Oh, yeah. You, probably just, you could be a house servant or something. Yeah. <laughs> you, 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 you just clean my toilet or something. I know, I'm going to be there. Move far from me, vanity and lies. Give me neither poverty nor riches. Feed me with food convenient for me. Lest I be fooled, deny thee, and say, Who is the Lord? Unless I be poor and still and take the name of my power in vain. That's why, yeah, that's what happens when you get rich and comfortable. When you're all about getting that money and you're comfortable, you know what I'm saying? That's how you see Jake get comfortable out here, man, because he's making all that money. He make all that money. He forgot the most high and then he fucked up. He, oh, Lord, I need you. Like, where was you at? That's why you don't see a lot of motherfuckers because they constantly. <laughs> or they go to church once a week thing they do us all. Because you know making money takes time too. Yeah. Making a lot of money. That's why <laughs> that's why I'm broke as hell. I, I waste too much of my time getting other kind of riches. You, cause, hey, hey, this is scripture say, you know where that's in the apocalypse? Uh, it said a man with wisdom got no riches. Uh, or something like that. Man, maybe I can't remember where it's at. Oh that too. That's a different one. That's a fun. We're gonna get a scripture. Cause a lot of brothers get comfortable, man. Malachi 3 and 6, for I am the Lord, Yehovah, I change not. Therefore ye sons of Jacob are not consumed. Oh yeah, the Lord don't change. Oh yeah, the Lord said he saved Israel. 
If he came to save Israel in the Old Testament, that means he don't change. That's why Matthew 15, 24 said he only came for Israel. That makes perfect logical sense. Are we allowed to use logic? We can't use that, can we? We just gotta use the love of Jesus. We got all, all, our, that's what I left out, the heart. We gotta follow our heart. Yeah. The scriptures say the heart is deceitful above all things. What's that, Jeremiah 19? The heart is weak, though. Man, the heart is wicked and evil. Because really, we're all wicked and evil. That's why we got to do what the Lord said. Don't follow our own hearts. We start following our own ways. You know, you're going, that's what these churches, they follow their heart. That's why I have to put this fucking faggot ass in. They follow their heart. They only love they love it. They be deceived. The heart gets you fucked up. They make you weak. Oh, that reminds me of like that Walking Dead show. You seen the Walking Dead when Jesus was trying to the dude's name in the show's name Jesus. Oh yeah, Jesus. He didn't. He, they took all the prisoners instead of killing him. He was trying to save them all. Yeah, yeah. Man, I would have killed them all. You know what I mean? That's what going trust in your heart gets you killed. You it's know like, what I mean? That's like Lord Moses said. He said, "I swear, this heart will get me zipped up in the body bag." Yeah, that your heart would get you, man. Your heart would get you killed faster, uh, quicker. Huh? Oh, that's pretty dope. But you fucked up. So that's what they see when they see us when they outside. That look pretty cool, actually. We look like some, some jeans. Like, oh, I don't want to say jeans. Oh, yeah. Y'all want to buy? We got, uh, y'all, we could get Israelite shirts for the low, low price. Of, <laughs> got the garments. Man, we, our shirts, though, $35.99. <laughs> We, we get, we, they cost plus, about... Oh, yeah, plus tax. Plus tax. <laughs> we get the layaway special. <laughs> Dad, you got to put a t-shirt on layaway. <laughs> Look at your boy over here. You know he a Freemason. You know that. I mean, I was just watching a video on YouTube. I don't know y'all... I don't know who I got it from. But it was a Baptist church or something. It was, oh. a, it was a Judite church. Oh, it, pastors. All the pastors. They, they told everybody to get out, and then when everybody left, they told them to go eat lunch and, and leave us be. And while they left, they always had a Freemason ceremony in the church. And they, they was all it was all Jake too, up in like just like a regular old Baptist church, a bunch of Freemasons. So you got a lot of these pastors, preachers, they actual Freemasons. They part of, part of lodges, and the Freemasons are devil worshippers. And I be battling with Freemasons all the time on my channel. And they always saying, uh, you know, saying that I'm ignorant. I don't just understand the mysteries. They was calling me uh, unclean. What did they call me? I forget what they called me. A, not an infidel. It was something else. But they was pretty much saying I'm just a mental retard that doesn't understand the mysteries. That's what Freemasons are telling me. Oh, I understand your mysteries, all right. The mystery of you getting fucked in your asshole. Yeah, you kept that a mystery, didn't you? Just like Richard Pryor, and Marlon Brando fucking each other in the ass. They kept that a secret for a long time, didn't they? Yeah, because the Freemasons got to take an oath. And Matthew, the fifth chapter says, uh, do not forswear thyself. To the most high you make your oath, and let your yeas be yeas and nays be nays. So you ain't supposed to take a big drawn out oath. You blindfold, they, you know a Freemason, they blindfold themselves. You know the garment they wear in the, uh, uh, in the ceremony, they wear some a garment that's old as hell. Some people said they thought the garment was at least 100 years old. It was all dirty and nasty. Probably had all kind of dried up nut over the years on it. And who God knows what else. But they wear this old nasty, tattered garment. And they blindfold themselves. And they, they have a dagger put to the heart. And they got to take an oath. And they, they say they reveal any of the secrets of a Freemason. They have their tongue cut out. And they get put to death. So where's that at in the scripture? I just don't understand it. Yeah, that's perfect. 
that ain't nowhere in the description. That's obviously demonic as hell. You know what I mean? That's why all these Freemasons, they just gonna get put to death. Hey, you see these athletes too, the way they do it? They get the brand. Like a lot of Ohio State athletes, they get they get their fraternity branded into their skin. Yeah. That's the Omega. It depends what fraternity did with. Yeah, they brand themselves. Yeah, they brand themselves. But that's the only way they're going to get their, uh... Yeah, that's how they're going to get their career. Because if you're not part of a, if you're not a, part of a, uh, a fraternity or a secret society, you're not going to be big in this country. It's a full of fact, like these free bases, man. They, they license plate, man. They got a little symbol. Yep. Let the police know. Uh, police ain't going to fuck with you when they see that shit. And ah. I know that for a member, Don, uh, her friend, he was a Freemason. He, he came yeah. over there and was like... I was drunk as hell, they didn't even pull me over. Nope. Because cops are Freemasons too. They have the uh the, uh the the fraternal order of the police. That's I think it's right down Main Street or Rick Street, one of them streets. Yeah, they got the fraternal order of the police, which is a, a fraternal order. It tells you in the name, fraternal. It's a brotherhood. That's what it yeah, fraternity means a brotherhood. Okay, so but what it is, they do everything in secret. And it is a brotherhood, just like the KKK's a brotherhood. That's why if you are caught, you ain't you ain't gonna turn another cop. You Hell know what you no. Look like. That's a game. <laughs> yeah, you'll be looking. At, they call you a traitor. Yeah, a traitor. They might. It, they'll set you up and have you killed. Oh, like like that, that dude up in Boston. Then uh, who was it got killed? A cop got killed. He was supposed to testify. Uh, the day before. The day before the trial, they, he turned up dead. <laughs> so the cop, man, the cops is a gang. They killed kill their own people. If they, if they, you know, go to testify against them. They ain't fucking around with y'all, man. Jeremiah 5 and 23, your iniquities have turned away these things, and your sins have withholden good things from you. For among my people are found wicked men. Ooh, among my people are found wicked men. They lay wait, and he that setteth snares, they set a trap. They catch men as a cage is full of birds, so are their houses full of deceit. Therefore, they are become great and waxing rich. Ooh, oh, that sounds like Nate. Uh, Nate Otto, my dad, out there, man. They're selling Isra Israelite t-shirts. Garments. they selling I Israelite memorabilia. Next thing, they're going to come out with commemorative plates. Oh, don't give him no ideas, Nate. But, oh, we on it. <laughs> We're going to get that commemorative plate, boy. They're going to have Nate on it standing like this. They're going to be with his second right-hand man. They're going to be together on the plate. They're going to put that plate on your mantle. You know what I mean? They're going to wax it. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, bro. They shine, yay. How's the Israel? Shield. Yeah. Yeah. They overpass the deeds of the wicked. They judge not the cause, the cause of the fatherless. Yet they prosper. In the right of my needy, do they not judge? Oh, what? Read that again. They wax. They are waxing fat. They shine. Yea, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. They judge not the cause, the cause of the fatherless. Yet they prosper. They're because they're not out here condemning our enemy. You know. Like, like, what, what didn't Nate make a video? We can't preach it. About Esau? Right, right, you know? Hey, man, where y'all go to Sabbath service at? Where's that? Sabbath service. Where you have your Sabbath service? Sabbath well, he just come out here and teach uh, on the streets. That's nah, what we do. Oh, y'all don't have a service on the Sabbath nowhere? Nah, we, I mean, we do our own little thing. Each, each person in their own household, you know? Okay. If we could get together, a lot of times, because the Sabbath changes from week to week. Yeah. You know, because we go by the lunar calendar in the Bible. Right. So a lot of times, you know, the Sabbath will fall on a work day and everything. No, you know, during the week sometimes. I know. Yeah. I know. So I mean, these curses, we got to work with the Sabbath. Yeah. No, what we got, with just all we got to work with. Right. Until you still come back. So, so yeah, our main teaching deal is right here, out here. You know, we come out here on. Uh, you, Mostly on Mondays lately, we be coming out on Mondays. Monday. And this is our big teaching day where we, you know, we just get going to scripture. Can they get a chance now to come over to the House of Israel, man? What you mean, House of Israel? What's that? Uh, that's on Broad. Right there before you get to Howland. That's where we have our Sabbath service. Are yeah. oh, you going to be here? Uh, Carousel, the head man. Uh, brother named Gerald. Gerald? 
Yeah, but he changed his name to a Hebrew name. I can't pronounce it right now. You said Hamilton and Broad. Hamilton and Broad? Broad and Hamilton. Yeah. You gonna be here next time I meet you? I see y'all money. All right, dude. Show up. All right. Broad and Hamilton? What's even our Broad and Hamilton? That's like all shopping shit. Yeah. That's where Applebee's. I don't know where that would be over there. Apple there's a nah. bowling alley. Banks. Car lot. Yeah, that's the shoe. That's the, that's the oh, he said y'all get shoe? Well, they might actually, I mean, you can probably actually talk with them guys. Taraz and them, they try to control you. They want to take over your camp. Yeah. You well, know what I mean? They ain't blaming my Right. Because yeah, that's what that's what that screw and that's the spirit though. That guy came up when he that that was the spirit that did that. Hey, what is, what is that scripture again? Because uh, that's what that says. If among my people are found wicked men, you will have people teaching. They're gonna be trying to get control of people just so they can take your money. Yeah, they just want. It, it's all for personal gain. They won't be a hot shot. They won't be the superstar. They want to be a great leader. And they, they want to get the money. They want to have the five wives. You know what I mean? You want to be seen a man. And they always like to brag about all their wives, too, don't they? You know what I mean? They like to brag about how many women they got. And they be like, oh, the Lord ain't blessed you with a wife, maybe because you're not keeping the commandments good enough. And that's what they'll say to you. You know? Shit like that. They, you know, some demons, man. You know, Faraz actually said something like that. Verse 26. Oh, you keep the commandments perfect, and the Lord will send you a wife. <laughs> like, damn, I guess I ain't never getting a woman. <laughs> <laughs> For among my people are found wicked men. They lay wait as he that set a snare, they set a trap, and they catch men. Yeah, they catch men. That's why they're doing a lot. Well, these churches, especially. But now, that's the thing with the Israelite schools now. You got Israelite schools catching men. Like IUIC is the big culprit on that one. That's a big, that's a rat trap right there. Y'all see that little cheese on there? Ooh, that cheese look good. You go over there and get that cheese. <laughs> neck, your neck is just snatched. You know what I mean? Bank account empty. Yeah, bank account empty. That's crazy. That's crazy. You know people have no idea what they call it. Tax writer. Yeah, tax writer. Yeah. Man, if you got somebody asking for your social security number, I think it's time to go. It's time to leave. <laughs> it's time What's to go. What's this got to do with the truth? Hell, I thought I thought that was the white man's shit. Hey, they probably probably they probably told him like we probably get two hundred dollars sign on bonus or something. What are they free agents? Oh, <laughs> the spirit of the Lord is out here today. Oh, now we're going to get it now. That's our fault. You know how they're going to blame it on us. We get the, we get the blame for everything. Yeah. He's supposed to be mad at the Lord. Yeah, the fat, yeah, the fats are the fat people the first to die. Hey, that's real life. Just think about when the shit, wow, that's a big point though. When the shit hits the fat, yeah, the fat people are going to be the first ones to go. You can't get away from nobody. <laughs> yep. Yep, scoffing. But yeah, cause just like, uh, the boy, he just got broke. He's probably talking shit about it. Hey, uh, I've never, I don't know. Hell no, they try to get up out of there. They try to get time to help you. Shit. They try to help themselves. 
like that tower that burned down over there in England too, man. Uh, you know? Hey, look at these people on, just on Black Friday. They kill each other over a flat screen. What do you think they'll do for a can of uh, well, the cabbage patch? Though. What do you think they'll do over the last can of spinach? Man, what was that movie? Uh, uh, Brad Pitt. Your whole family gonna die because uh, of the World War Z. Oh yeah, movie, World War Z. that's a good one. Brad Pitt. Yeah. It's, 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 it's gonna be a survival horror game out here, like Resident Evil. You know, survival horror. You only got like three bullets. You got like, uh, you, you got hardly no. There's no med kits. No, there's no. Uh, there's no safe spots for like miles and miles. You know what I mean? You got one little bit of health left. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You living? Yeah, you doing that? <laughs> hey, we would have put a gang, put a, put a hunter on your ass. You know what I mean? Six is twenty-two, and suddenly shall the stone places appear unsown. The full storehouses shall suddenly be found empty. What does that say? Suddenly the stone places will be unsown. Shopping centers, grocery stores, carryouts, McDonald's, White Castle, Ooh, Wendy's, don't tell them that. Burger King. Right now. No more no, McDonald's. Right, your refrigerator, your cabinets, your pantries. People, people, they're gonna be quick to start eating dog food. You know, I heard a lot of poor people eat dog food already because they can't afford real because they can't afford the real food, so they buy dog food because it's cheaper. Yeah, it's big getting big chunks of meat. Turn that shit into a stew. Yeah, they do that. Who I heard somebody talking about? I was watching this uh, Chicago Blues documentary, and they had uh, what's your boy Dick Gregory was in it, and he was talking about it. He's like talking about how a lot of people in the hood they eat dog food. That's all they can afford. Trumpet shall give a sound, which when every man hears, they shall be suddenly afraid. At that time shall friends fight one another. At that time shall friends fight one against another. They can like, probably any motherfucking word. Let's say there's something that falls through the world. Like the birds of the trip, I don't know if I'm doing the bird of the trip. Oh, they just feel, they made me feel like they're family. Motherfuckers will kill you, man. Damn, you gotta get beat in. Like that. Like that. Don't you gotta get beat in? You gotta either get beat in or go fucking get a body. Hell no. Hey, they be quick. Like, you fuck up, they gonna throw your head off right away. They look like. Oh, yeah. Oh, you my brother. Yep, so as you go against their ordinances. Hell no. Ain't no mercy up in there. Hell no. This is mercy right here. Until the Lord gives that power again, we're gonna fucking put hands and feet on y'all fucking He said, Hey, neighbor, how you doing, man? <laughs> yeah. I was a white man. We're gonna be stomping them all like, uh, what's your yeah. girl, Mortal Kombat, to jump up in there and oh, land she on you? We're gonna, <laughs> boom! <laughs> I actually want to do that. He said, oh, we're going to do the bicycle kick. Right, <laughs> Luke Kang, hit your ass with a bike. <laughs> hey, that's going to be a good time. Hey, the Lord, we be able to do shit. No, you can really do shit like that. Yeah. If you can, the Lord give you that, that training spirit, you can hit somebody with a bicycle kick. Yeah. It'd be fucked up. Yeah. yeah, that spirit hit you. We already know how to do it because we've seen it on TV. I, I tried it before, you know. <laughs> you already know. <laughs> you see Bruce Lee. We've seen Bruce Lee movies over and over. So oh, we already yeah. have it on mind how to do it. So the spirit hit us, man. We're going to be perfect at it. Yeah, because Bruce, <laughs> Bruce Lee, man, he had, he had some lightweight superpowers. Thanks, you coach. Think about it. Bruce Lee was raggedy compared to how we used to be. Just think how King David and them look. Oh, he put Bruce Lee to shame. Uh, well, look, Samson killed, how many Philistines he killed with the, uh, the, the jawbone of an ass? How many look that up? Thousands. Yeah, I look that up. Thousands of them. I'm sorry, I keep cutting you off in that script. Oh, it is all good. You got it, still bring it out. Yeah, I got it. Right. <laughs> I, I wanted to hear that script. We got a Bible, we got a Bible, we got a Oh, yeah, yeah. I got it. All right. Oh, let me get that script. Hold on.
spiritual power, man. Spiritual power. Uh, little piece of shit. Two outdoor high north from Lebanon stops to Polaris Parkway and State Street. I got this girl. Let me read up on real quick. Just get brothers. Uh, I mentioned it. This is Judges 15 and 16 in Samson. That's the best name in the box.